Celebrating Hispanic Heritage on Wish TV is brought to you by Eskenazi Health, Bose McKinney and Evans, and Camacho Janitorial. One way cultures are celebrated is through food, and one group of women is making sure their tradition of homemade tamales are savored this Hispanic Heritage Month. Yeah, News 8's multicultural reporter, Katira Winfrey, takes us to Vision Academy, where kids got to try them out, and some for the very first time. Moms with Rise Indy spent several hours making 400 chicken and cheese tamales. They say it's important to share this culture so it's not forgotten, but also to expose these kids at Vision Academy to something new. Trying out something new sometimes takes a bit of bravery, and it may be even a bit confusing. But taking a bite is worth the try. Probably for the many of our kiddos, this is the first time that they're getting to eat tamales. Vision Academy youngsters got an opportunity to taste test Mexican tamales. Ava Rosco Clara is one of the volunteer Rise Andy moms who put in the work to get it done. She's been making tamales her entire life, first under the guidance of her mom and grandmother. Es algo grande para mí. It's very exciting to share something that's run down in my family to everyone here and share that and also show it to my children and make sure they practice it and don't forget the tradition. A day before passing out the finished dish, moms gathered in a small kitchen, creating a sort of cultural assembly line, taking the chicken, corn flour, husks, and turning it into a meal. I just want to appreciate everyone for being there because there were people from Mexico, Nicaragua, Honduras, Guatemala, and the United States, so I appreciate everyone. Orozco Clara is now passing on the knowledge in her own kitchen to people familiar with this type of cooking and those trying something new and sharing it with all of them. So the word tamale means uh, wrapped. To have this experience now where they get to experience cultures at this age is important because we all know as you move on in life and you get to college, those experiences become bigger. So having that exposure now will get them set up for success. This type of exposure is what Vision Academy leaders hope for its student body, showing them different cultures while showing the power of collaboration and community. Having the opportunity for us to be here uh, and expose our kiddos to this experience, it's a big thing. Reporting in Indianapolis, Katira Winfrey, WishTV, wishtv.com, and like us on Facebook.